Well, it's official. Freedom Act Lubbock has verified enough of those signatures to put their petition in front of city council. In a press conference today, the city secretary confirmed the petition's legitimacy. The initiative aims to decriminalize low-level marijuana possession in the hub city. Adam Hernandez, communication chair at Lubbock, Imp Lubbock Compact, was encouraged by today's announcement. Yeah, so we're just uh, really grateful for the city staff who took all of their time and effort to verify all of those signatures that they went through. They didn't count every single one, but they counted 8,000 of them. We know that was really hard, and we appreciate them for their time and effort in doing that. We're also really grateful to everybody who signed the petition, all of the volunteers who helped us to collect those signatures, the citizens who went out there to collect signatures or to spread the word about Freedom Act. So what happens next? Well, the initiative will be brought before City Council next Tuesday on November the 7th. Then they will have 30 days to hold another public hearing and then have their final say about adopting or rejecting the ordinance. And if they say no, that's when it will go on the ballot for you, the voters, to vote on in our May elections.